Fever is a frequent uh, complication of antineoplastic chemotherapy in children, but uh, the frequency of this complication is mainly related with the kind of chemotherapy. That means that uh, it is quite frequent in acute leukemias and it is present in near 50% of uh, episodes of neutropenia, while it is less frequent uh, in uh, children with solid tumors that uh, develop fever more or less in 30% of uh, episodes of uh, neutropenia. The problem in this case is, uh, again, uh, the choice of antibiotics. Since uh, the increase of resistance is uh, need changes in the approach, we use antibiotics at the development of fever because we can face an infection that could kill the patient in a very short period. But what is needed now is that, uh, is that the, um, the choice could not be based anymore on the results of clinical trials. Since uh, now the increase of resistant pathogens like uh, Gram negatives uh, uh, with a standard spectrum beta lactamase of even worse in some countries, the presence of uh, gram negatives uh, with uh, produce, uh, producing carbapenemase could reduce uh, the efficacy of uh, the treatment approach. So, at present, the best approach is probably that of uh, checking very carefully the epidemiology in any single center and decide which is the best treatment strategy at the beginning. For example, in my hospital, we decided to start with a combination of uh, a beta lactam uh, active against pseudomonas and uh, some grade of gram negatives and aminoglycosides. This is quite different from what is recommended, that is the use of uh, a single beta lactam treatment, but uh, in our hands, uh, this approach lead to a risk of failure of the treatment in presence of gram-negative bacteremia that is around the 5% of the cases, while the monotherapy could lead to a, a risk of treatment that, is, that ranges from 10 to 25%. And this could give the patient a better chance to, to, to survive to this uh, complication. So I think that today the best guidelines to give to children, to physicians treating children with fibroid neutropenia is to know very well their local epidemiology and decide which could be the best treatment for the most uh, uh, worsening, most uh, fear, uh, fearful infections and decide the treatment strategy on the basis of these results and not only which on uh, what is reported in the in the guidelines